Hey there, folks, and welcome back, I guess. Costco Rotisserie Chicken. Of course, they're famous for their $1.50 hot dogs, but I, I just devoted a whole episode to hot dogs. So we're going to focus on their chicken instead. For only $5, you get this big hunkin' piece of chicken. Oh, you gotta, you gotta love that potato dextrin. Of, co of course, we have done chicken on this show before, but never a rotisserie chicken. And especially not one at the bargain basement price of $5. You know, for once, I'm, I'm saying that this is a good deal. Ah, fit for a king. Oh, the, the Costco secrets finally revealed. And you get a free piece of string with every chicken. God, the sounds it's making. I did chill this in the fridge so that it would be easier to tear all the chicken apart. Not bad. We got, I think, most of the meat off of these bones, and we got a ton of meat to sausage with. All right, I'm, 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 I'm pretty sure we got all the bones out, but if not, the grinder will sing a different story. Now, the, the thought process is that there's enough skin and collagen and general grease to keep this chicken moist. I'm, I'm, I'm hoping the skin is our saving grace here. I was not prepared for how much meat this was actually going to produce. I feel like there's more chicken now than when we originally started. Man, that's a, that's a, that's a, that's, that's going to make a whole lot of chicken sausage. You make me feel like I'm living a sausage dream the way you put the casing on. If I could just say once again that $5 is what a, what a value that is. I, I, I hope this comes out of the tube. This, this may be too dry. We will cross that bridge when we get to it. Oh, oh God. Oh. The heavy ones always cause the most problems. But I don't want to sound like a simp for Costco. I have some gripes about Costco. Really, really, it's about the people that shop at Costco. It's, it's, it's survival of the fittest over there. You gotta, you gotta, you're fighting with everyone to get those rotisserie chickens. A lot of blood is spilt in the aisles. That's all I'm saying. It's like, uh, it's like Mad Max with shopping carts. And you may be saying, well, that's not Costco's fault. Isn't it, though? All right, well, let's hope that's enough casing because that's, a whole lot of chicken. Well, there's there there's no chicken water, so that's in this case that's not a very good sign. We're we're up in the dryness level on this quite a bit. And three, two, one. And here's another thing about Costco. The whole premise is that you buy in bulk to save money, but I bought like a tub of toothpaste and, and the rotisserie chicken and I walked out of there with, with spending like $200. I'll buy, I'll buy a lead sausage. That's a thin sausage. I think I'm gonna have to grab more casing. We're about two thirds the way done, and 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 we still got a ton of this. There's still there's still a little bit left in the canister, but I, I'm not too worried about it. it. It's certainly not the most attractive looking sausage. D doesn't it look like guts? I don't think I'm gonna make it, Sarge. With special thanks to today's Mark Boxalo box artist. This guy! Remember the time the Ruffalo box was cl- I think all the mess on the box gives it character. This Will It Blow is brought to you by Helix Sleep. Tired of feeling tired in the mornings, noon, afternoon, evening, night? Enter Helix Sleep, the makers of premium mattresses and bedding to fit your specific sleep needs. Stop blaming those 9 p.m. Red Bulls and espresso shots and start blaming your old dingy mattress. I've had my Helix mattress for over two years and it's still just as comfortable as the day I unfurled it into my life. That's because all Helix mattresses come with a 10-year warranty. So I still have eight more years of solid sleep left on this bad boy. Just take the sleep quiz that matches your unique body type and sleep preferences to the perfect mattress for you. I'm a back sleeper and I like a firm mattress. And along with a few other answers, I was matched with the Dusk Lux mattress. And what a match made in heaven it is. Mrs. Sausage says I fall asleep as soon as my head hits the pillow. And I tell her to quit watching me sleep, you weirdo. Once 
you and your mattress have been matched, Helix is going to deliver it to your door for free. All Helix mattresses come with a 100 night sleep guarantee. If you don't like it after 100 nights, they'll pick it up for you and give you a full refund. Helix Sleep also has financing options and flexible payment plans, so a good night's sleep is never out of reach. Just click the link below or go to helixsleep.com slash ordinary sausage and get up to $200 off your Helix mattress. There's no chance. Well, that, that ain't that ain't gonna blow. I apo I apologize. You deserve so much better than that. Wicka wah. Oh, that's not very good. I I don't I don't think there's enough room in the pan for both of these. All right, I'll tell you what we'll do. This one will go in the pan. This one we'll throw in the toaster oven. See which one's better. Here we go. Let's give it some breathing room. Yeah. This this one's done. Well, it's it's a it's a difference that you can see clearly, but is it a difference that you can taste? That's that that's what we're gonna find out. So uh, you know, let's let's open them up and see how we did. This one, of course, is the uh what? This is the one that we baked in the toaster oven. Um, and it, it doesn't, it, it doesn't look too dry, I guess. But we'll see how this one does. Almost identical. All right, I'm going to try this one first because I think that it will taste worse. Here we go! It's, it's not bad, but the chicken is dry. And now we'll try the pan seared. Surprisingly, this isn't as dry. They basically taste the same. The only difference is, is the level of dryness and um, the, the color. Even though both skins are crispy, this one looks like it was boiled. I'm in a conundrum because on the one hand, it tastes better than cat food sausage, but it's, it's not really better than cat food sausage. You don't get that rotisserie taste to it once it's ground up and then cooked again. Uh, so I think I'm going to have to settle on giving this sausage here a Three out of five. Bop, 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 bop. Also, just try getting out of a Costco. They got longer lines than Disney World, but they have a 12-pound USDA prime brisket for like $40. So what am I going to do?